naman, kamusta kayo? Sa video na ito ay papanoorin natin yung laban ni Marjolin Didal sa Battle of the Berics. Tama yung narinig nyo mga man, Berics, I mean the Berics. Sino ba naman ang hindi pinapangarap? O sino ba namang skater ang hindi pinapangarap na makapaglaro sa Berics? Kasi halos lahat ng professional skater na kakilala ko, kakilala nyo, ay nakapaglaro na sa Berics. At naging kabilang dun si Marjolin Didal mga man. Akalain nyo yun mga man ano, galing Pilipinas, galing Cebu, proud Pilipino, proud Bisaya, makikipaglaro sa Berics. Yung makakalaban dito ni Marjolin Didal mga man, eh bigatin din si Adrian Slobo. Si Adrian Slobo mga man, taga Simi Valley, California siya. So pag narinig kasi natin yung California, malamang automatic, puno ng skate park yan, magagandang facility, magagandang gamit, at maraming professional skater talaga ang galing dito sa California. Kahit si Ryan Sheckler mga man, galing yan sa California. Tapos makikipaglaban si Adrian Slobo kay Marjolin Didal na opposite naman ng sitwasyon sa Pilipinas. Sa Pilipinas o specifically sa Cebu nun, mga man e developing pa rin lang yung skateboarding. Maraming malalakas sa Cebu nun, pero wala pang masyadong suporta galing sa gobyerno para makapagpatayo ng maraming skate park, masuportahan yung skateboarding as in developing pa lang talaga. So magiging magandang laban to panigurado. Kaya wag na natin patagalin yung intro, panoorin na natin yung unang laban ni Marjolin Didal sa Battle of the Berics. My name is Adrian Slobo. I'm from Simi Valley, California. My name is Marjolin Didal. I'm from Cebu City, Philippines. Yeah, Margie. I've been skating for seven years already. I started skating um, about 11 years ago. I just thought it was something cool to do, meet some new people, so I fell in love with it. Like, first time I stepped on a skateboard, I know how to ride, and like, and they're surprised, they're like, oh, she can ride, do you skate? It's like, nah, that's my first time. And they say like, oh, you look comfortable, and then like, it's so, like you can come next week and then you can skate with us. So like I'm super high. Around every corner. Ayun nga tama si Adrian taga Simi Valley, California, si Marjolin taga Cebu. Maganda maganda yung maganda yung istorya nila. Sabi nga ni Marjolin Didal, unang tapak niya daw sa skateboard marunong na agad siya magrides. So ibig sabihin gifted nga talaga itong si Marjolin Didal at deserve niya talaga mapapunta dito. I was a skater so I think we all just would mob to like local school parking lots and just practice like kickflips and everything so it's pretty easy so i grew up skating uh in streets in, in cebu my hometown which is really kind of illegal so every time you skate in the street the the guards like pull a shotgun and like hey no skating it's kind of tight i don't really think about like struggling about like skating because i'm just like having fun and enjoying while i'm on a skateboard i remember i heard kind of like the whispers a while ago like a really long time ago and nothing really happened so i was like yeah they're probably just not gonna do it and then just in these incoming weeks i got the text and i'm just like so pumped yeah i was so pumped like i got multiple dms from people who worked at the barracks they were like yo we're like putting your name in like look out for that and i was like sick dude i'm down i don't really think i mean i think I mean, sino ba naman ang hindi masisik talaga yung parang may excite kapag nareceive mo yung text message nakasali ka sa battle of the barracks i don't really think i mean i think about a competition but every time i skate with the other girls with the other people it's like you don't think about winning the event. It's all about like skating and having fun around them, messing around. That's skateboarding. Yeah. If I wanted, I think it'd be like just a really sick experience to be the first woman to do it. Like, I don't know. I think that would inspire a lot of people. Even if I don't win it, whoever wins it is going to be like really progressive for female skateboarding in general. We made it here, so sick. <laughs> Very nice introduction, kaya panoorin na natin yung mismong laban nila. We're at the first ever Women's Battle at the Barracks. This is Margie, this is Adrian. And all right, <coughs> let me get to these rules. This is flat ground only, but that doesn't mean anything on flat ground counts. No feet on the ground, that means no no complies, no hand, hand plans, plans, no, no bonuses, bonuses, no grabs. No grabs, no doing tricks that slide on the ground if your opponent... Malalaman mo talagang nanonood talaga si Marjolin Didal ng Battle of the Barracks kasi kabisado niya yung rules eh. It popped her trick. No multiple manual shit. Last layer gets two tries. Each skater gets one challenge. Offensive toe drag gets one do over. Defensive toe drag has a bigger margin, margin for, for error, error, but will ultimately be decided, be decided by, by the referee. Debbie Brown. Let's keep it clean. Let's keep it lean. This is women's battle at the barracks, and there's only going to be one winner. So may God have mercy on your souls. Roshan Bow. Roshan Bow. One, two, three. Adrian goes goes first. Kick flip. Kick flip. 
komportable ng komportable si Marge din didal dito sa game na to. Lalo na yung 360 flip na yun. Take it flip. Sobrang consistent nila parehas. Lolly kick flip. Switch kick flip. Yan ang sinasabi ko kay Adrian talaga. <laughs> That counts. <laughs> Redo. Easy. Okay, S para kay Adrian. Pressure hard flip. Very unusual pero ang galing. SK. Sobrang steady din talaga ni Marjorie din. Dito. Oh, three letters na siya. Bone half cow. <laughs> Kick flip pretzel. Uh, pretzel pala tawag din kaya cross flip. Okay, hindi niya nagawa yung signature trick niya na yun. Fakey heel, mali din. Para kay Ayun, nabuo yung fakey heel ni Marjorie din. Last try para kay Adrian. Ganda talaga nitong laban na to. Ah! <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> Nakaulit talaga si Margie na yan. Sarap kasama niya. Lolly! <laughs> Paano niya na... Paano niya pa nabuhi? Hey! Sixty shove it. Last try para kay Adrian. Nice game. The winner, Marty. <laughs> Excited, Sabi na abe, medyo ner nervous talaga dito si Marjorie din dito. Second time meeting her. Uh, I don't know, I'm just having fun. I don't expect good or bad. I just like enjoying it. It's like kind of being nervous, like, oh, am I gonna do good? But like, I don't care, just like having fun. And it went well though. It went well though. I mean, some of my tricks earlier, I'm gonna do it again. I'll try some tricks that you never ever see. I don't know. I'll just have fun. Nice, Marjan Indidal. Congratulations. Sa unang laban ng Women's Battle of the Barracks, akalaan mo siya, siya yung nanalo agad doon laban kay Adrian Slobo. Nagaling Simi Valley, California. Napakaganda nitong laban na to mga man, ano? Kasi hindi mo feel na parang competition siya. Parang, na, ano, parang regular na game skate lang sa local spot nyo, ganyan. Parang game of skate ng mga kaibigan lang, katuwaan lang. At yun yung nangyari dito sa battle na ito. Walang bad vices, walang, you know, parang seryosohan. Laro-laro lang. Yun lang, sana nag-enjoy kayo. Salamat sa panonood mga man. Ingat kayo at skate safe lagi.